The Fire HD 10 tablet comes with the tablet, of course, which has a built-in rechargeable battery, a power adapter, a USB-C 2.0 charging cable, and some papers. Features and anatomy. Now let's get to know the tablet. The 1080p Full HD display is 10.1 inches. The one I purchased has 32 gigabytes of digital storage, but you can pay a little more for 64 gigabytes if you need it. At the top of the tablet is a two megapixel front facing camera. On the back of the tablet, you'll see in the upper left corner a five megapixel rear facing HD camera. On the top of the tablet, you'll see two integrated speakers. The left side of the tablet has nothing on it, but I wanted to point out how thin this tablet is, at just 0.36 inches. It weighs only 16.4 ounces. The right side of the tablet has the controls, including the two up and down volume buttons, the power button, two built-in microphones, the USB-C 2.0 power port, and a 3.5 millimeter stereo jack for headphones which I really like. It's not some odd connection like some manufacturers provide. The bottom of the tablet has a micro SD slot for adding external storage, which I find super handy. Charging. First, let's charge the tablet's internal battery. I'll plug the larger end of the charging cable into the power adapter. Then I'll plug the other end of the cable into the tablet. Finally, I'll plug the power adapter into a wall outlet. The tablet takes around four hours to charge from zero to 100%, less if it's not completely drained. A fully charged battery lasts around 12 hours, which is good in my opinion. Well, I hope that you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.